Today I'm reviewing the Pac-Man Connect and Play. It looks like they released this on the 35th anniversary of Pac-Man. And that was, I believe, in May 2015. And what I'm doing here is I'm, I'm doing a quick unboxing of the game. And it's fairly simple to get into. There's a, a couple of pieces of scotch tape around the edges. And I end up having to cut, cut the uh, edges right here. And what I like about this device is it's sh it's in the shape of Pac-Man, which is really cool, and it's pixelated, so it, it looks it has that 8-bit shape. And here I'm taking a look at the manual, which I'm I'm <laughs> surprised that there's a manual in here and has a little bit of information on each of the included games. Um, and there's a total of 12 games in this Connect and Play. And it's bent. Look at that. Uh, I'll need to iron that maybe with uh, <laughs> to see if I can flatten that out. But uh, it's pretty cool. I'm glad it came with a manual. And then it's it's in here pretty good. It has the little wrapping. I'm going to have to cut around all of this. So I'm going to play that in sort of in a fast motion here. As I try to dig my way into this without damaging it too much. It took me quite a while to get it out. <laughs> and once I did, I was glad because uh, on the other side of this is it looks like the Pac-Man screen from the game and then uh, right there and then checking out the device you have the A and a B button the B is on the left it's kinda hard to see it's pixelated and the A is on the right and then on the uh, bottom it, there's nothing really on the bottom you just pop it open to throw in the four, I believe, double A batteries that is needed. And then you have your RCA style cables that you plug right into your um, RCA ports on your television. You do need a flathead or a Phillips screwdriver to get into the battery compartment, which is sort of a bummer. Mm -hmm. I wish they um, would improve that part of the process. Uh, maybe a Make it easier to get into these things because it's tough. I, maybe it's more kid friendly like this. So there's the battery compartment. And we'll slap some batteries in and give this thing a run through. There's a couple of negatives to this unit. Um, and pretty much the, the joystick handle itself and the controller, it's pretty good. It, and the buttons, and they're, you know, they're, they're clicky buttons. But the, the handle itself is springy, so that can cause you to, uh, if you slip, it makes Pac-Man go the opposite direction, for example. And then the other negative that, that I encountered was after holding the controller for about 10 to 15 minutes, I've discovered that the pointy edges of the controller itself dig into your hand. So that's not, that's not very cool. So. The controller appears to only support a left-handed configuration and it doesn't look like there's a right-handed configuration mode for it. It makes me long for the Ed Ladin Super Twin 78 or even the Supreme 78 All Play 4 slash 8. But in all, this is a great de little device. All of the games are arcade mode. From what I can tell, they look exactly like the real arcade games. And so I really enjoy this device and I, I do recommend it. Pac-Man Plus, Pac-Man 256, Mappy, High Scores, Galaxian, oh that's cool, Galaga, Dig Dug, Xevious, Bosconian, and Rally X. Very cool. So let's try Pac-Man. Press and hold A plus B to quit to game. Okay. Why did that was a control issue? A waste of free boy, free man. I want to see the intermission anyways.
scores even though I yeah so I didn't get my high score because I, I turned it off before B to return maybe I'm just not holding long enough I think that's what it is. Plus. It's so springy that causes problems. Oh, okay. So, you press and hold, and then you get that menu right there. Press and hold. so cool it simulates the level 256 glitch okay mappy jump I suck at these games that's mappy rally X This one you have your flags. And of course it runs right into me. I 
I've never seen Bosco Man. Let's see what the Bosco Man is. Okay, I'm not very good at this. Xevious. favorite dig dug Thank mm -hmm. you. 